Welcome to episode three of the Pitch a Bun Motorbike Tour series. Today, my plan was to go ride Highway 2331, the road I came here to experience. But I've changed my mind. I decided to hang around here in Pitch a Bun for another day or two and see what this city has to offer, including a museum that might get this video demonetized. Very local, very traditional, I've been here for 24 hours. I haven't seen one other single foreigner the entire time I've been here. I'm about to be getting on this main road for about an hour to get us to the museum that might possibly get this video demonetized. So I'm gonna show you anyway, but if you want to support this channel, you can do it in the link above. Hopefully it doesn't get demonetized though. I will, uh, use some choice code words we'll see i found an alternative route to get me off the main road this is much much better damn this bike is slow oh but the road's so good sick A 10 bot entry fee, which is like 30 cents. And now we are at the, um, I will call it the Pew Pew Museum. YouTube doesn't like that W word or the G word. So we'll just call things Pew Pews and Bang Bangs. This is not going to be 100% factually correct, but from what I'm getting from this, my understanding is there was a war that started in 1968 with the Thai government and the Communist Party. And what this museum is, is a place to display the pew pews from the Thai government. These are the pew pews that they used to fight the Communist Party for almost a decade. Man, that thing is cool. I want that just for like a yard ornament. I don't have a yard, but that is cool looking. In March of 1981, this tank was hit with an RPG rocket. One person died and two were badly injured. The engine's still in it. What is that? It looks like a small block Chevy. Oh, I just noticed there's a cat in here too. What the hell, cat? Bruh, this is an M101 rocket launcher this is a freaking rock can i say can i say rocket on youtube <laughs> 105 millimeter are you kidding me this thing is heavy yeah it's recording okay 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 thank you okay move, 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 move. okay 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 Okay. Did I do it right? <laughs> you want next? You want to try next? <laughs> okay. Thank you, bro. Cop and cop. Thank you, cop. So this is the Zero A1 Bird Dog. Uh, it was pretty much in use the entire time the war existed from 1968 up until the early 80s. Pretty cool. I really like the uh, Pew Pew Museum. Especially for only 10 bucks. If you're in the area, highly recommend it. Now we're on to our next stop. One of the most beautiful temples in all of Thailand. Now, I don't go to temples much on this channel because, well, after you've been here for a year or two, you just become templed out. You've seen one temple, you've seen them all. But that is not the case for the temple we are going to today. Trust me. Remember when this was possible in America without going to jail? Bye bye. What's your name? Nice to meet you. I'm Chad. Yeah. <laughs> Be safe, okay? You are on YouTube. Check out that guy's load. That's a huge load. That, that didn't, that didn't sound right. These little Toyota Tacomas, 
They're called the High Lux here. A Mighty X. They are the go-to work truck in Thailand. Look at that. That is nuts. This really is a beautiful part of Isan. I've never thought of Isan looking like this. In my years of being, there's the temple. That's where we're going, guys. That's it. Yeah, I never thought of Isan looking like this. In my head, I always pictured it as basically like the Midwest version of Thailand. All these beautiful mountains and curvy roads is not what I expected. But it just goes to show you how diverse the country of Thailand is. And even the diversity, the diversity of each individual province. This is next level temple. Like I said before, I really am not into the whole temple thing anymore. I've just done it over and over and over for so many years. But this one is a must see if you are in the Pichabun area. Holy crap, it's amazing. And we haven't even got to the main attraction yet, which is right here. The five Buddha. Look at this thing. Wow. Okay, I, uh, wow, I, I'm in awe. And the temple itself is not only just stunning, look at the view. Look at this. Hands down the most beautiful temple I've ever been to in Thailand. Sanctuary of Truth is not a temple, it's a museum. This is an actual temple. And I've never been to one in this country that is more stunning than this one. Wow. Honestly, I'm struggling to find words on this one. Uh, what do you say? Besides beautiful, magnificent, stunning, must see if you're ever ever in the Isan region come here to whatever this temple's called i already forgot see if i could remember i probably couldn't pronounce it correctly this is the name of the temple it's crazy when i was here before on my Isan thailand motorbike tour series i drove on one of the roads on my motorbike and i saw this temple from the distance and i said man i gotta go check that place out then the laptop broke i had to go back to kun ken but what matters is i made it here now and uh definitely put this on your bucket list i hope you enjoyed this video. dude this is the ride back to the hotel look at this holy shit man i hope this is coming through on camera as epic as it is in real life wow insane that is beautiful what a great day